guys welcome to this tutorial now we have to open our unity 3d now click on new now we have to give our project a name i will give it as moji prank app now click on create project now it will open up our unity 3d workspace now click on file, build settings, click on android, then click on switch platform. Now close the window. It will configure the build settings. Now we have to download the Euphoria SDK for Unity. I will give the link in the description. Now we have to download Euphoria for unity so here is the file now we'll double click the file it will start uploading and we have to click on import now it will start Preparing the Vuforia SDK folder into the assets, we have to delete our main camera and load our AR camera which is present in the Vuforia prefabs folder. We will also have to add the image target into AR camera. We have to create a license key. So go to Vuforia developer portal and add a license key i will give the link in the description to create the license key give the app a name i will give it as moji prank click on next now we have to accept terms and conditions and click on confirm click on the license name and here's the license we have to copy the license and paste into the field the app license key into AR camera now we have to download our target manager so we have to create a database that is the 500 rupees node database I will give the name as Modi video play click on create Now we have to add a file that is the image that is a 500 rupees image I have scanned the image and crop some portion of that node I will load the node into the add target section I will give the width as 320 now click on add Now we have to download our database for Unity Editor. Double click the package, click on import. Now we have to check the load our database name that is in my case it's Modi Video Play and click on activate. Now we have to go to our image target and select our database which we have loaded just now that is Modi video play in my case. I will zoom out by scrolling down the mouse. Now go to our AR camera and give the rotation as 90 degree. Move up the Z axis. Now we have to download the video playback sample. The link will be given in the description. We have to click on the 
download for unity i have already downloaded it extract to v4 er yeah, that samples i will extract it on my desktop open the folder and double click the video playback file Now we have to make sure is you have untick the scene folder. Click on import. Now we have to go to your assets. Now we have to go on Euphoria Video Playback, then Prefab Folder. Now we have to drag the video into Image Target. Now again click on Assets, Streaming Assets. Now here the video will be present. I will delete the already present video. I will add our video. I will drag the video into Unity Streaming Assets folder. Now click on Video, F2, press F2 and Ctrl C, we have to copy the name of the video along with the extension of the video. As I am having .mp4 extension, I will keep .mp4. Now we have to move up the video so that the video will be above the 500 rupees note. Now click on asset script. Now click on trackable event handler and draw, dra drag it to image target. Now we have to remove our event handler that is the default event handler. Demo component. Now we have to click on video and click on auto play. So that's it. We have created our fully functional app. The Modi Keynote app, which is a bit famous on the Play Store. I will save into the assets the Unity file, the whole project. I will save the whole project. I will click on build and run and click on add open scene so we will add our company name we can also add our identifier own identifier i will give my identifier as in dot my surname dot the app name we can also give the company name Now click on build. I will save it on my desktop. So it will start creating our APK file. So here is the APK file. I will save the apk file on my phone so I will copy the apk file to my internal storage Now we will start installing the APK which we have just created in our phone. So let the app install.
we will start up our app from the drawer so here is the app which we have just created so here is the app so when we target the camera on our target which we have given in the Vuforia portal which we have created it will start playing the video thanks for watching don't forget to like comment share and subscribe